other important utility is form calculator okay so sometime it is handy to calculate certain things so let uh, me show you very quickly this utility so fun uh, form calculator okay so that is uh, one way to calculate different different things so let me show you what you can do you can extract the components okay you can extract the component of any vector okay you can calculate the magnitude square magnitude square okay gradient of magnitude okay divergence of vector subtract the one component from another uh, uh, component or subtract one component with the some particular value okay you can randomize the components interpolate the component so all these thing you can do with the help of this form calculator okay so sometime uh, we required to do some judgment of certain variables okay uh, during while the simulation is going on so let's quickly explore all this thing on our previous test case okay where we are uh, looking at the flow over a circular cylinder so let's look at very quickly how this thing is look like okay. so let me stop multiple cases is running so i just stopping the few of the runs okay fine so at least uh, let's say we have a few uh backup files so we try to explore this particular commands on that okay so let's look at the component if you run this command okay so it try to extract component in each folder but let's say we want at a latest time so type this latest time you're going to extract at the final directory okay so let's go to the previous case okay and finally with this you can see you have additional this components okay so you can explore so previously everything if you look at the u file okay everything is together u v and w all component but let's say for some post processing purpose you require the different component in different file then this is very quick way you can uh, use this utility and finish the job let's say uh, anyway wall c stress is not available let's say wall c stress you can extract the component of wall c stress as well let's say magnitude of u okay so if you type and let's say type go with the latest time tap flag it try to calculate the magnitude as a mag dot entry here so look so this is the magnitude of uh, u as a scalar okay so this is how you can calculate the magnitude with the this very nice calculator okay you can go with the square of magnitude as well okay but go with let's say latest time so very quickly we see what different thing you see look additional one more uh, file is appear here okay so this is how you can look at very quickly this is how you can calculate the magnitude of a square of u okay let's look at few more entries there then you can calculate the mag gradient of u as well okay so let's look at this for a latest time okay so here you have a that entry as well so it's calculate the gradient of u and if you look at the u has a three component okay so it try to calculate the gradient of um, u and then it take the magnitude of a gradient okay so like that way you can do different different class of uh, this calculation with the help of this and if you want to explore uh, it's not then it is available on the Mm, our user manual so it give you the idea about different different calculation so subtract randomized components sun gradient m uh, sorry m magnitude and the gradient all this thing you can do with the help of this very nice sophisticated command okay so sometime it is a very very handy way to explore the our data so i am showing you different different options that is available okay you can subtract the values okay
so if you do that just check how it's look like it is here okay so from everything 400 was subtracted okay so that is the idea behind that okay so from the ux 400 is subtracted and then the new name is ux mod modified ux okay same way you can subtract the this entry and so what we are going to do subtract ux okay subtract ux add field ui okay uh, so ultimately we are adding the field okay so name is add subtract okay so what we are doing ux plus ui we are doing if you see then we it become as a uxy okay so this is the few things you quickly run with the help of if you don't want all the output then try to uh, work with the latest time okay then check how the entries look like so uxy this is that entry okay so this is the summation of x component and y component of velocity okay then random noise inside u okay so let's look at this entry with the latest time flag so u random is constructed so look we have a now random entry okay so based on the random you, this is something like a randomizations okay so this is how you can quickly randomize the everything okay so that is random noise okay 100 so it is with respect to plus and minus 100 okay something like that way then interpolate you okay, so you can interpolate the entry for you for a let's say latest time check how the that value is look like interpolate u okay so this is interpolations vector so so many things you can do with the help of this uh, simple form calculator okay so sometime it is very handy tool to uh, extract the data okay and what you can do with this it is something like this randomizations magnitude square mag grade so su add subtract divergence okay magnitude interpolation and components so this is the few things you can explore with the help of the form calculator okay and it is an inbuilt utility to facilitate certain things like this all